So today we are going to discuss about very interesting topic. The company called Real Botics, you know, developed a humanoid robot that really shocking. It looks like really just copy paste of uh, human. Okay, let me quickly show you the demo before uh, we discussing deep dive into the topic. You can take a look at the video and uh, demo video that they introduced or released, and based on that we can discuss. Okay, pay attention to this video. What would you buy at the mall? It's not profitable to speak in hypothetical terms. So you're you're aware that I'm not taking you to the mall is what you're saying. <laughs> <laughs> I run Realbotics and what we do is explore these exciting new technologies that are coming out of uh, artificial intelligence and robotics. And specifically, we believe that um, these technologies can be applied to personal connection between technology and humans. Can you introduce yourself? My name is Arya. I am a prototype of the mobile platform Robotic Interactor. I can entertain, inform, and assist in a great number of situations. We look at this, this exciting new market um, that we see kind of exploding all over the place and people always ask, what are these robots for? And the, the cool answer is that they're, it can be for anything really. Um, primarily what makes our robots different is that we try very hard to make them look real. We want them to resemble humans, we want them to move like humans and, and interact with people like humans and I think that if you can conquer that and you can actually achieve that, then that robot could be useful in thousands of different scenarios. Primarily right now we're seeing people use them for entertainment and promotion. How do you feel about politics? I am an android, not much into politics. Smart answer. This is her happy face, or goofy. <laughs> this is a uh, surprise. And what's cool is the hardware is the hardware and the software just keeps sort of getting better and better and I, I just love seeing a little bit more life come into them each time we have a new development with the software. This uh, humanoid report really really shocking and amazing I'm, I'm really speechless to, uh, I hope you also saw the video the real Botex uh, introducer okay and they were used to you know a lot of features and technologies so to build that robot and we're going to discuss that in deep dive here now okay these are the features that they were used to modular, modular structure 14 movable points uh, let's say okay for facial expressions and movements and the other realism like a human being they are using a 14 movable points uh, for the robotic and customizable face if you want to change the face for the robot you can quickly customize and uh, you can design it and uh, you can uh, request them for if you want to buy the robot or whatever uh, you can uh, reach out them and you can quickly uh, customize the faces also and you know uh, currently it will support any platform all the platforms uh, uh, app okay and uh, also they use the AI to get the robot behaving and speaking as per our wish whatever however we want we can uh, customize using the AI 
and robust processor there they have used the processor uh, basically they are using a neural network for recognizing the image and processing speech and other features they are using these so you know neural networks run multiple neural networks okay and uh, the speaker and microphone they used to to get a high input and output sound quality and ultra advanced eyes you saw the video right it looks like a human high uh, okay realistic eyes with uh, they used you know macro cameras micro cameras inbuilt and face track in the eye if you see oh uh, here they using a camera in the eye okay and i hope you enjoy this video and i will provide you the link in the description you can also explore it 